Hello and welcome to this video. Today we are watching a match between King Soli and Stockfish. King Soli playing as the Spartans here and Stockfish over here as the Romans. Straight away I'm doing stuff except for the... Except for the men. Although King Soli's men and women going straight away. Oh! Stockfish with three Equus Romanus before any kind of anything else. That's this is a rush by the looks of this. King Soli opting for a more traditional approach with the five ladies to start and then just, just another one. Got the wicker baskets coming out. Setting up for a, a traditional kind of game. Stockfish pumping out three horses straight away, then three ladies. The three horses grabbed a bit of food and then he even went to the trouble of garrisoning them inside of his civic center before sending them on to save them that little bit of travel distance. Oh dear. King Soli will notice this very soon. About now? <laughs> oh, I <laughs> noticed for a second anyway. And then gone and then back again were the horses. Oh, they're doing stuff. King Soli doesn't like what the stuff that the horses are doing. I can tell you that. This is a fact. These horses also have uh, 1.5 times versus other horses. Um, so if Stockfish does come up against some of King Soli's horses, like this one here, he will have 1.5 times benefit against it. So two of his horses could take out, would, would be an even trade against three of King Soli's Spartan horses, although they are ranged, which does help. The Roman starting horses are, are melee spear units. Interesting, he's just got them sitting over here for now. He had that little raid and prevented some early income from uh, King Soli. Unable to collect these berries, food, which is causes him to be unable to increase his population very well. Good sentry tower over here will ensure his ability to collect wood. Could go from there to transition just into a uh, farm in a more protected area. We'll see what Stockfish is doing. Farmstead near the fig trees. That's nice. I like the Roman houses. There's a little thingy there. Back to King Soli. And king Soli wouldn't be feeling like a king today. Well,. At that the moment, it seems pretty okay. Maybe a minor, minor little dent in the resource collection, but not a lot. Enough, though, I, I would say. Enough to cause a problem. Berries will be collected now. That raid causing the baskets upgrade to be not as valuable for King Soli. Stockfish going far and away now on population. Preventing the early food is number one. If you're raiding, so if you if you're if you are stockfish, just imagine you are stockfish. Imagine you are really good at zero AD for a second. 
you would... <laughs> if you came up over to here and saw some people on wood... Let's say this isn't here. Saw people on wood and people on food, where would you go? You'd go food. Those berries. I mean, especially if you see a farmstead right here. There is a high likelihood that the, the other has... That your enemy has researched this baskets, wicker baskets, technology. Stockfish collected all of the wood. <laughs> King Soli has more wood currently, but uh, we we'll, may have some troubles spending said wood. Barracks is a good way to spend the wood. Or to enable yourself to spend wood in the future. Units are a more valuable use of wood. Units or <laughs> a building to make more units. At this point in the game, you just want to get a lot of resources. Fending off this raid, but this is five units who are not collecting resources. Resources, 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 resources. Imagine there was a video of a Microsoft trade conference or shareholder conference, I think it was. And uh, Steve Ballmer, I think it was, had his big bald head on there, sweating on stage vibrating, jumping, dancing, yeah, shouting the word developers over and over again. Imagine that, but he's saying resources. That's zero AD. That's the first 10 minutes of zero AD. Resources, resources, resources. He's even, he even claps when he does it. As if to hyper-emphasize its importance. I mean, he was right. Developers are very important. In fact, if you are a developer, Zero AD needs you. <laughs> please help. <laughs> please help Zero AD, please. Zero, look at all this art and stuff. It's great. Just make the engine slightly better. Ah, it's fine. It's especially fine in these 1v1s. This one which Stockfish... Eh, nah, eh. He's 20 units ahead. He's 20 units ahead. And he's Romans in the early game. Romans generally... Their strength is in the late game. Their strength is when they get siege units out. They shouldn't really be this strong in the early game. Unless... <laughs> unless circumstances such as the ones which have occurred here occur. Where the Romans have caused their enemy to... Oh, look at all these Leonidases. They're not Leonidases, but... <laughs> As long as the Romans cause the enemy to not be able to collect resources. That's basically the thing with Romans. I mean, generally I don't particularly enjoy seeing a horse rush early game strategy. But if it's Romans, I mean, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> That's my opinion. Romans can rush and I'm not sad about it. I mean, what else do you do with Romans? Not much else. Stockfish demonstrating the way to play Romans. Here. Yeah. Early game rush. Pre prevent early resource collection, which prevents early population gain. Which prevents more resource collection. And it all just pile, it just... Exponentially, almost. It almost exponentially 
becomes bad <laughs> for the enemy if you do such a thing. There's one Leonidas coming out here. I would probably say that uh, King Soli is um, just taking that last few seconds to think, well, is there actually a way out of this? Before I press resign, is there a way to extricate myself from this scenario? And I, if I had to guess, I would say that this will take King Soli maybe another minute or two. And then after discounting all possibilities, I'm well not discounting them, but uh, considering them implausible, the resign button will soon be pressed thereafter. Not long now. <laughs> oh, this was disastrous for King Soli. He started really well too. Early game rush. Maybe it's something that should be expected of a Roman. Or expected of a, a stockfish. If your enemy is either a Roman or a stockfish, get, you might you might want to prepare for a rush. Is uh, that's that would probably be uh, best the best strategy. It's over. The game's over now. <laughs> Guaranteed, he resigns within the next thirty seconds. There's no. You got no food. You've got. There it is. All right. <laughs> Yeah. Ah, dang. Dang. That's what I would be saying if I were old mate Soli over here. Soli or Soli? I think Soli. Soli, it would have an extra E. Hmm. Stockfish demonstrating how to play Romans. Interesting. I don't know what much else to say about the statistics. In a game as short as this, it's not... There isn't much to talk about. What's this total score uh, from units? Where's that, where's that big spike come from? Hmm. I don't know. I won't be able to find it anyway. I hope this was enjoyable, and I hope that you have a good day.